Well, today that I'm filming this is iPhone, new iPhone release day, iPhone 15, 15 plus pro, pro max. Um, however, right now, I'm actually here to talk about a case, and not an Apple case. So this is a case from Pitaka. I've actually done a review on one of these products years ago, um, and it ended up being one of my favorite slim cases that I've ever owned. This is a carbon fiber, or not a carbon fiber, it's technically a, an aramid fiber case. Um, it is MagSafe, so it does have the MagSafe magnets built in. Um, it does not have the directional magnet, the little one that sticks down below. Um, not that that really makes a huge difference, but in case you're looking for that specifically, it just has the MagSafe charging capability and it does stick to the MagSafe chargers as well, really well. But this is the MagEase Case 3 from Pitaka. So let's bring the video in and I'm going to show you again, one of my favorite slim cases that I own for my 14 Pro Max, most likely will end up on my 15 Pro Max as well. So this is the box that it came in. Um, just a pretty simple slide. Oh, boy, this doesn't want to come out that way, does it? Oh, there we go. There we go. Just pretty simple. It just came in this nice protective box. Um, so it's just uh, paper. So it is nice that you can recycle that. So that is nice. But this is the, uh, the like I said, the MagEase 3 from Pitaka for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. They do offer for the different size phones. Um, this is the 1500D design. Um, so that's just the, the type of uh, aramid fiber, what it looks like. You can see my fingerprints on there even a little bit from the camera point of view. I've been using this pretty much nonstop. I love these cases. They're, they are protective on scratch and stuff like that. You're not gonna get a whole lot of drop protection because there's not a whole lot of you know, wiggle room. It's just gonna protect the, the, the phone itself from scratches and stuff like that. Um, but it, is, it has a nice feel to it. Um, it has a really nice look to it. That's the big thing is that carbon fiber type look, right? And of course, feel. It has this matte, just nice feel to it. Still, um, I had one, I've, I think this is my third one total. Um, I haven't had one for several years and, I, uh, and I've been doing all sorts of videos in all sorts of different cases. But this uh, is probably my favorite thin, low profile case I've ever had for any of my iPhones. Um, and it doesn't disappoint. Again, this is similar to the one I've had years ago. Um, but of course you can see that it does have the MagSafe ring built into it. So wireless charging works great with it. Like I said, it does not have that little directional one down here. Um, so that's the only thing that it's missing. I don't miss it for what I do. I think I only have one. Uh, I mean, obviously the, the wallet, I don't use the MagSafe wallet. I, I own one, but I really don't use it. Um, but that would be the only thing. Uh, aside from that, everything else works really good with it, but I love how low profile it is. And once you get it on the phone, it just does not want to let go of the phone. So let's see here. And you, it, because I'm not, they're not like, they're just cutouts. They don't have that little bar around it. It's not going to break off as easy. And also you don't have to worry about which way you put it in. But once you snap it in, it just, you can feel it snap in and hear it. And that sucker is just like part of the phone now which is what I love about it. It is it is as close to you can be having a naked phone, um, obviously giving yourself a really nice look as well with scratch protection and everything, but not trying to, to oh yeah, whatever, no, no, no. This literally is one of my favorite cases. They have, excuse me, different designs. So like I said, this is the 1500D design. They have a 600D, I think. Um, one that has kind of a blue with a two-tone color. They have several different ones. So I will put links in the description where you can check this out on Amazon. Uh, retails at like 59 bucks. Um, but again, that aramid fiber is what, what it is, right? It's just, it's really nice. I really like it. And it, it takes a beating. I mean, I've, I've, I've hit it with a, a bunch of stuff. I mean, obviously you can see some scuffs and stuff on it, but uh, it, it's kind of interesting because it kind of rubs off. It's just a, it's a really nice case. I, I really like this case. So when it comes down to it, um, this, if I'm being as honest as I possibly can, this is on my top five cases that I've ever owned from any phone that I've ever owned. Um, I'm really, I'm a huge fan of the Aramid Fiber cases from Pitaka. Um, check them out. Um, I will put links to this specific one that I have for the 14 Pro Max. They offer for the 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max and 15, 15 Plus. 
Aramid makes, or I should say, Pitaka makes a lot of different um, Aramid fiber cases. Um, so definitely check them out. Uh, highly recommend it. I will also put links directly to their website if you want to check them out there as well. So yeah, Pitaka, keep up the good work. Um, as much as I think I had one for my iPhone 4 or 5, that was my very first one, and I loved it then. I love it. I, I continue to love that case to this day. So thank you for watching to the end of the video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Uh, hope you like what you see here. If you uh, like what you see, hit the subscribe button. Come on back. And we'll catch you back here on another future video review. We'll see you soon.